When I first got this lock, it had been stuffed full of latex paint. So I turned an oversized tension wrench that had originally started as a hair clip into a knife, scraped it all out, and restored this lock to a fully functional wafer lock. And now, Colton Plus Plus has given me a challenge to pick this lock open using my feet while wearing shoes. So first step is I can't hold in onto anything with my toes. So tensioning is difficult, but I have this hole in my desk and this thing on my toolbox. And if I combine them both with a master lock for additional weight, I can then use gravity to tension the lock for me. There we go. That gets a decent view of everything. I have everything on the pin. Now I just have to put it in the hole. And never mind. Excellent. Excellent. Let's make sure that's in focus. There we go. Now, move myself way off to the side so far that I can't actually see the keyway in order to put in my tension wrench. Awesome. 
So now I have the lock under tension. And now I can take my pick and start picking the lock. The hardest part of this entire endeavor has been keeping the lock from falling off of my desk. This is actually my third possible setup. Oh my goodness, I got it already. Oh my goodness. That is an unlocked lock. And now because I planned it out, I'm going to actually open the latch. Do that, I just need to rotate the keyway the, uh, the rest of the way around. There we go. Don't need that anymore. I'll flip this over. Stick this back in the other hole this time. Flip the lock back over. that light. Hopefully we'll have a bit less shadow. Bam. Colton Plus Plus, thank you for the challenge. That was a very fun bit of problem solving over the last couple days. Peace out.